what is up guys and welcome back to a brand new video and to this video guys i'm gonna be telling you if you know call of duty remaster the one that is coming this year of course is gonna be you know call of duty 4 remaster so do you guys want this call of duty to be you know to be able to be bought separately so when i mean separately i mean you know you don't have to buy the legacy edition so you can get this game so you know a lot of people are already excited for the next call of duty you know call of duty 4 remaster i am so excited for it who doesn't want to play already you know i'm already tired of uh black ops 3 and you know we won a new call of duty already like come on like we are like halfway there we are about to hit june school is about to be over the summer is about to come and of course once the school starts by the time we are in november we're gonna get the launch of call of duty infinite warfare plus call of duty 4 remaster so you know we are so excited for it and i want to tell you guys something you know do you guys think that call of duty 4 remaster is gonna be bought separately so like i said activision they are really smart and they are not going to sell call of duty 4 remaster separately so they already said that they don't have any plans for changing that so that means you know hell no bro you're not gonna be able to buy it to buy it separately and that is a good thing you know that is a good thing for a lot of people because you know especially for the for inf for activation because uh, by making us buy infinite warfare plus uh, call of duty 4 remastered the basically you know getting the legacy edition they they are going to make a lot of money and that is a that is a i mean that is a good thing for them but for a lot of people like us who want to get that only who a lot of people want to get you know call of duty 4 remastered by itself they're not gonna be able to and they have to pay literally $80 if you're in the USA of course if you want to get the game with Call of Duty 4 Remaster so I mean there's gonna be a lot of people who are gonna make a lot of big mistakes uh, buying only Call of, Duty 4, Call of Duty Infinite Warfare you know only paying $60 because there's no other way around to get it so you better keep you better think what you're gonna buy this year in Call of Duty because we are getting two Call of Duty this year and of course it's not gonna be you know Call of Duty 4 remastered it's not gonna be able to be bought separately so that is uh I mean for a lot of people it's not a big deal because people who actually buy Infinite Warfare will also want to get you know Modern Warfare remastered and that is why they're gonna buy you know of course that is why they're gonna get the legacy edition so um, that is a great deal I will say so what do you guys think about this you know because a lot of people are excited for this game more than infinite warfare which is crazy like the main game which is infinite warfare it's not gonna be you know like it's not all the hype like you know it's not like hype 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 all the time all around all everywhere for infinite warfare it's actually for modern warfare remaster I mean I'm so excited for Modern Warfare Remaster and I and I think a lot of people are too so you know we gotta get the Legacy Edition that's the way to go you know Activision they have no plans to change that so I mean guys come on we can't do anything you know we don't choose uh, what to buy now we just have to get the Legacy Edition if we want to get it and yeah it's not gonna be able to be bought separately I mean a lot of people are pissed about it and I'm not pissed because I will still buy Infinite Warfare. You know, we gotta try it out. We gotta see how it is. We might like it, and if we and if we do, then you know that was a good deal, right? Now we're getting two Call of Duties this year, and if the sales go very well with the Legacy Edition, we might be getting the the next year after Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. We might be getting from a sledgehammer a remastered Call of Duty probably from Treyarch you know like Call of Duty World of War let's say or I don't know I bet you we might have a remaster if actually the you know the sales like just go like boom if the f sales are really high for the Legacy Edition and a lot of people are playing the remaster that means that ne the next Call of Duty we might have also a beta plus 
a remaster game which is gonna be crazy so you know everybody's excited about that we want remaster call of duties we want boots in the ground and i bet you that they will i bet you that they will do it because like why would not not do it right why would not do that right all right so yeah guys that was it for the video what do you guys think about this because activision doesn't have any plans to sell call of duty 4 remaster this year separately so they are launching both of them at the same date same 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 day november 4 at midnight you know we are getting two call of duties at the same time but there are rumors that it might be call of duty 4 remaster sell no you know come first like one month before the infinite warfare so we just have to wait and see but uh for right now we have we are getting both of them at the same day at the same day so we are excited we have like five months away or six i'm not sure five i think i don't know it doesn't matter so yeah guys that was it for the video and if you enjoyed it of course give me a thumbs up leave a comment down below what do you guys think about this do you think the activation is actually gonna change the plan you know they have a plan that no hell no guys hell no we're not buying this up we're not we're not letting you guys buy it separately right that's what they think and they have no plans so that's probably gonna stick around the whole year and maybe forever so yeah guys that was it for the video and of course peace out